What up, guys? Casey Holmes coming at y'all today with a new shoe review on the Chima Estate and the Chima Estate Rubber. Jumping straight into it. Of course, you know, you got your nice collar here that pretty much just sets aside from the regular Chima Ferguson Pro that stopped about here for the first model. Then you got your nice Ultra Cush Light footbed. Super comfy. Nice sock liner in there to grab your heels. Won't be slipping around in there. Nice and flexible. I always love team of shoes. They're really light. You know, never too much pressure on your feet. There's that nice toe cap on this version. This version actually didn't get released. Um, it's more of a uh, test out and it didn't really do so well, I guess. I mean, I could definitely say it's not the prettiest shoe. But... It didn't look the worst. I mean, I definitely like how the toe cap had its division in there. And it wasn't like a regular thick toe cap. He kind of just had the division in there. And I feel like breaking this in, it would be pretty weird. But I definitely feel like when it got, once it got broken in, it'd be great. Uh, some ollie area right there. Kind of scratching the canvas a bit. The suede pair didn't skate. Scarlet gum. Really nice, deep red satin suede. And I mean, you know, you just got your pretty much all around great shoe, man. I mean, Chima Ferguson always makes things nice, lean, and mean. So, I mean, if you really like them, go out there and search on the internet and check them out, man. Definitely a great chill shoe for a Sunday skate session.